does not like climbing this thing at all. Yeah, uh, that cruise prop doesn't doesn't climb. Yeah. Especially in the summertime. Yeah. All right. All right, and 500 feet. Left 270 to 2000. Put back on. Yep. 500 left to 27. Number 6 on Mike Alpha, turn right direct to FA-83. Right direct to FA-83, you want Mike Alpha. Um, remember, uh, Victor Airway is class Echo airspace. Correct. So, to maintain VFR, you need to be 500 feet below the clouds. So, if you're at 2,000 feet on the MEA, clouds have to be at least at 2,500 for you to cancel IFR. Right. That's pretty much what you do if you would cancel IFR. At least we still have an hour. Yeah, that's at 10 gallons an hour, that is one hour. Maybe just a bit less because the right one's teetering on, but the left one's over it, so it's about 10. We're also in a climb, but it'll Maybe show a little more once we level. Yeah. Take a peek out the left. And down. Oh, take controls. My controls. Your controls. You get that for the girlfriend. That's right over Epcot. Boom. About to fly right over the Magic Kingdom. Sweet. Remember, 46790, you can proceed back on home direct to Melbourne now. Contact approach 132.65. Just let them know you like the localizer approach, please. 3265, have a good day. Let me send it. Uh, Cyrex to Melbourne, 3265, and we'll let them know localizer 46790. Oh, shit. What? Oh, fucking hell. There's your Pablo Telus and maintain before 3,500. Travis, get your 10 o'clock okay. and 5 miles yeah, down. Just west down. Down. 3,000 VFR, Seth. 3,500 VFR, we're looking for our traffic, zero Pablo Tell. Come in from the back side of it. Yeah. Alright, no more fucking around. Alright, you got the controls. My controls down to 2,000 feet, correct? Down 2,000. Yeah, it's showing. Here's your Papa Tell V4 out to now your discretion. Uh, the traffic's no factor. There's additional V4 traffic at your 12 1230 yeah, maneuvering 3,605 miles. Type on them. Alright, we got him on the TCAS, we're looking for the visual and uh, VFR discretion. Any chance we get to turn towards the airport here? Yeah, we're just getting ready to do that. Uh, you can turn right when you're able, heading zero, uh, let's make it zero five zero. Zero five zero on the heading and we're looking for the traffic zero pop up tail. Doesn't look too bad. It's, it's like a just a bit of rain, isn't it? Number zero zero pop it's gonna maintain three thousand that traffic's no bad. Three thousand nine zero 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 pop. Zero, zero Papa Delta VFR yeah. traffic, South Factor pass yeah, off your left side there at 10 o'clock and about 4 miles, appears to be north 10 out, 3600 feet indicated. Kind of approach 121, 21-1, just let them know you're heading, please, and uh, have a good day. All right, we'll call with that and good day, Zero Papa Delta so. It looks like it's blowing past the airport. Yeah. Alright, there you go, 2000. What do you end up running into? If you're in the middle of like a... Number 601 Mike Alpha, there's some light to minor precipitation building over FA-83. appears to be just uh, just about a mile west of it's clear, but it's just over top of the airport now, a little bit to the east of there, just so you know. Uh, Roger that, we have it in sight. Like I said, it looks like it's uh, moving off to the east. We might be able to get in one Mike Alpha. Yeah, but it appears like the, if you go up the west side there and then mount from there, it's, it's your best bet. It's just barely on the edge of the west side of the airport. Yeah, Roger that, we'll, uh, we'll end it from the uh, west one Mike Alpha. Thank you.
Yeah, if you get stuck... Zero, zero, pop, yeah, but it's going to maintain 2,000. 2,000, pop. Anything more than a moderate precipitation? Yeah. The downforce can shove you down. Right. And uh, that could be a... That could be a big issue. Yeah. Um, I've like been stuck in some stuff like that in a Cessna. Yeah. Climbing at like VX. Zero 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 pop are reaching 2,000 and are right down for runway 25. All right, uh, 2,000 will enter a uh, right downwind for runway 259 0 pop. thanks. You just confirmed you said you did have the airport in sight or not yet? 900 0 pop has the airport in sight. Zero pop, thanks. You've heard a visual approach on 825, the contact executive tower 18.7. Have a good day. Give me about 10 to the left. 10 to the left. I want to give a little space so we can kind of. Pen number 0 0 pop, you've heard a visual approach on 825, executive contact the tower 18.7. Have a good day. Okay, uh, clear for visual approach over to tower, 9000 zero, zero, pop. Yeah, there's like even more. Yeah, so we're going to have to fit ourselves in through that hole. Got tra is that a traffic yeah, or is a that a bird? Bird, go left. Fucking okay, hell, it's all going on. Hell yeah. Over 601 Gavin, there is a Cessna traffic inbound to Leesburg for the uh, GPS 231. Uh, I may have to just hold you out until he gets in. It shouldn't be a factor, but just so you know. And if you are going to uh, cancel high power part of the approach, just uh, just let me know. Uh, Roger that. We are on uh, minimum fuel as well for 671 Mike Alpha. Mike Alpha, right. It should be no factor. I'll just, just keep me advised that he's slow moving there, but uh, it should be no issue. But I'll let you know as you get a little closer. Uh, Roger that for Mike Alpha. Thank you. Should we cancel? Yeah, we can go ahead and cancel. And approach 6 uh, six on one Mike Alpha, we'll, uh, we'll cancel IFR at this time. 6 on one Mike Alpha, Roger, IFR cancellation oh, wow. is received. And uh, you can proceed inbound at your discretion, FA-83 out at your discretion. That precipitation is still just on the uh, west side of the airport. Looks like if you head up the west side there like you're doing, you should be you should be just on the edge of it. Uh, Roger that. We look, looks like we've got another uh, bit of rain coming from the west as well. We're going to try and fit ourselves in between the two of them. One Mike Alpha. Roger, thank you. Well, Mike Alpha, if you stay with me, I can give you updates on the weather, but if you'd like a frequency change, uh, just let me know when you'd like to do that. Roger that. We'll stay with you for uh, a few more minutes. One Mike Alpha. Go ahead and drop to 15. 15. Full power, running light on. Sure, that's on both. On the carriage, down. Probably just quiet seat belts. Next time we'll get fuel. Yeah. If we absolutely need to, we can pop. We have enough to get to Leesburg or Orlando. Right. Um, a popka. Cessna 52606, contact Tampa approach on 119.9 or 99. Have a good day. 199 for 52606. Appreciate the help. Be wary of wind shifts, um, cross winds gusts, and shear. All that downforce is yeah. picking up stuff. Come in maybe with a little bit more power. Yeah. I'll, uh... All right. 601 Mike Alpha, the weather does appear to be slowly moving to the east there, I show FA-83 just, just on the very edge of the light precipitation there. And uh, the other traffic uh, is now 1.30 to 2 o'clock, 5 miles directly over FA-83 at 2000 inbound to Leesburg. So, so. Alright, uh, from our view, uh, the airport's uh, wide open and clear and we're going to start our descent down for it. Mike Alpha, Roger, Raider Service is terminated, you can squawk B4 for the change crew, have a good day. Squad VFR, and uh, you have a good day too, sir. Thanks for the help today, one Mike Alpha. Okay. All right, go ahead and uh, square it up. Yeah. Like the edge of that field. Yeah. Orlando North, Cessna 671 Mike Alpha, is about five miles south of the field. 1,500 making in for runway nine. Alright, go ahead and go visual. Point visual. Just in case there's any gusts or anything. Yeah. Yeah, that precip lightened out. But then it's yeah. Well then that one's coming in. 
got about five to eight minutes after we touch down before that one hits probably. Yeah, so we better get it done quickly. Yep. All on and off, Cessna 601, Mike Alpha Tony, final runway nine, all on and off. Yeah, look at the puddles on the side of the runway. Dissipate hydroplaning. Well, this is the drop station. You guys have a test on one, but you do about five miles northwest from the field. We'll be planning to join a uh, right down one for runway 23. Wellington. Winds appear to be calm. Yeah. Bit of rain. Alright, cut the power. Bike Alpha, down runway 9, taking it to the end, and we'll be off the ramp.